What's going on you guys? It is Wanny back on your screen bringing you a brand new video in Greenville, Wisconsin. If you are new here, make sure you smash the subscribe button down below to join the Wanny family today. And today we are going on a family vacation to driving empire and we are going to be renting a boat to go out on the ocean i am so excited first we got to wash up the g-wagon over here it is a little bit dusty from sitting in the garage for a couple months i mean we have been going on a lot of vacations this summer guys leave a comment down below where has been your favorite trip that you have gone on this summer break so let's go get the children and let's get on the road we're even going to be picking up Uncle Lincoln for the surprise vacation. I am so excited. Good morning, chill. What are you doing watching TV this morning? Oh my gosh, looks like some craziness is happening in the world. But guess what? We are going on a boat vacation to Driving Empire. I'm so excited. All right, well, we got to grab our surprise lunch. Yes, we are. I'm so excited. We got a surprise lunch in the fridge that we'll be eating on the road to Driving Empire. And then we will be going to pick up Uncle Lincoln. All right, we got the lunch right here. Come on, son, we gotta go quickly, quickly, quickly. All right, let's unlock the car with our phone app and let's get on the road, you guys. I am so excited, everybody. You know, we have a lot of places that we are going to be going to explore and it is going to be a lot of fun. So we gotta make sure the house is all locked up and ready to go. And we are on the road. Say goodbye to our beautiful home in Greenville and we are going to be going on a fun family vacation. All right, we're getting on the main highway right now. Luckily, Uncle Lincoln lives right down the main road from us. And, you know, he is a great neighbor. So he is going to be in complete shock that he is going to be joining us on this family vacation. I think the G-Wagon startup triggered the AMG's horn. Oh my goodness. Well, the neighbors will have to listen to that for a little bit, okay? All right, we're pulling up to Uncle Lincoln's house right now. As you can see, his beautiful Lincoln SUV is parked outside. You know, he loves that vehicle a lot. Look at how nice this is. All right, let's go ring the doorbell and surprise him. Oh my gosh, I think he's doing something in this room over here. What is he doing? Making the bed or something? Hopefully he answers the door. Oh! <laughs> wow, I thought that we had trick-or-treaters or something already. Good morning, Lincoln. Hello, hello, hello. Look a little chill here. Yes, we are going on a family Surprise vacation! Oh, are you serious? Excuse me, we do not ring the doorbell that has helped things break. Chael, stop playing with the doorbell. You want a timeout? Oh Thank my you. Goodness. All right, oh, well, back to this. we are going on a family vacation. <laughs> Woo! So excited. Let's get in the G Wagon. Grab your things from the house, Lincoln, and we are going to be getting on the road here All pretty right. soon. I am to, so excited. Let me get some important stuff here from the garage. Oh my gosh, you, you want me to pull on this Lincoln in the garage? Wanna, oh, yeah, sure. Want to make sure it doesn't get damaged here because, no, you know, no, no, no. some people are a little bit crazy in the neighborhood. Yeah, no, we do not want any damage. All right, let's park the Lincoln in the garage. I mean, it is a beautiful, beautiful vehicle. Do you want to make sure nothing happens like to it? a piece of jewelry. It is definitely like a piece of jewelry. Get a good photo of it, chill. All right, all right let's get in the car and let's get going, guys. I am so excited. But, you guys, I have a special treat. We are going to be going to... Breakfast! Ooh, I'm starving. Actually, we're gonna get some breakfast snacks from the gas station. So, hopefully, they have some good meals there because you guys never know what they are serving at a gas station. But we're gonna pick the best options that we can find because we have a very long road trip to Driving Empire. I mean, it is going to be many, many hours. But luckily, our Mercedes is almost self driving, so we get to relax as the G Wagon roars down the road. I mean, this is the perfect family vacation vehicle it is like a big box fits everything that we need and it definitely little top heavy little top heavy makes it swerve as we take a turn but that is okay put this puppy in sport mode and we arrive anywhere very quickly so we're pulling up at the gas station right now we got to stock up on road chip snacks i am a little bit hungry this morning so we definitely definitely need some good snacks maybe they even have a good breakfast sandwich we can find there i know those are pretty good all right, we're going to get a good parking spot right over here. And guys, we got to run in the store, grab everything we need, and get on the main road. All right, let's go. Lincoln, grab a bag of ice. We need that for our road trip drinks as well. All right, let's see here. They got a little convenience store right over here. Let's see here. Hmm. Chill, you see these over here? We got some goldfish. We got some pretzels. Let's grab these jerky packages over here. Lincoln, you find anything good? I think I found some... Uh... Those are good. And All right. Are Anything else? 
Oh my gosh. Well, I guess you could get the Flaming Hot Chips, but make sure you don't get it on the interior of the car because that will make a mess, okay? And I got some of my Sun Chips, my favorite flavor. Ooh, there. those look pretty good. I think I need to get a bag of air on the way out. I mean, you know they do not make a mess, so they are perfect for a road trip. All right, let's grab some air chips over here. Mm. Where's the cashier this morning? Hello? Anybody here? Excuse me. Sir, we'd like to buy some things. Guess we gotta check it out at the burger house over here. Yeah. All right, sir, we got some bags of chips yeah. and we got some road chip snacks here. Thank you very much, sir. What is our grand total going to be this morning? I think it is it buy one bag of chips, get three right. free. Perfect deal. Oh, yeah. All right, thank you very much, sir. Uh, Have a great day. We appreciate it very yeah, much. All right, you guys, these chips are really good. Thank you, yeah. have a good day. All right, we're getting in the G-Wagon right now and we are going to be headed back on the road to get to the ocean. We are going to be going on a boat vacation, everybody. I am so excited. Oh, Look at this too. beautiful car for a road trip. I absolutely love it. So let's get on the main highway right now. It is going to be one of the best family vacations we've ever been on. Oh my gosh, you already made a mess. We've literally been in the car for like five minutes. Are you crazy or something? Oh my goodness. Seriously, chill. You're gonna have to clean that up when we get to the vacation spot. So we're taking the back road to Driving Empire and it is going to be a great family vacation. So we will see you guys when we get there. All right, we finally arrived here in Driving Empire, you guys. We are headed to the dock right now. How excited are you, Lincoln? Oh, so excited here. Super excited. We are going to be driving on a super yacht, you guys. Seriously, we better punch it here so we get this light green. Here we go, here we go. The dock is right down the road, son. How are you feeling? We are going to be driving in the largest vessel in all of uh, Driving Empire. Oh my goodness, I think I can see the top of it right over there. Look at it. I am so excited, you guys. All right, we are going to find a good parking spot right over here, and we are going to be boarding the boat that I am going to be driving. All right, let's head into the parking lot. Perfect, we gotta get a good parking spot, you guys, right over here. There we go. All right, there we go, everybody. We are parking the G-Wagon right over here. We gotta unload the car, and we gotta get all of our luggage for the super yacht, you guys. Come on, you guys, let's go quickly. All right, so excited. All right, we got all of our luggage and let's get going, you guys. Let's head on to the dock and let's start loading the boat. Yay. I am so excited to be driving this oh, huge wow. vessel. It's gonna be a little bit scary. I don't know if you can handle that, Lanny. I'm a trained professional, Lincoln. Definitely trained professional here. So let's go, you guys. I'm going to be boarding the boat right now and we'll be leaving for the ocean in just a moment. All right, you guys, we are aboard the super yacht right now, and we are roaring through the ocean. Oh my goodness, you guys, this is so cool. I cannot believe we are going on one of the largest vessels in the whole driving empire. This is seriously so cool, everybody. All right, you guys, as you can see, there is Mount Kilimanjaro straight ahead. It is one of the tallest mountains in all of driving empire. It is known for being absolutely freezing up there and you know it is impossible to get to the top of it so we are roaring through the ocean right now and we are going to head as close as possible that we can to go check it out hopefully our super yacht fits under this bridge you guys i don't know if we're gonna be able to fit hopefully we can fit uh this is wanny to lincoln are we able to fit under here i think so i believe so. i think it's gonna be a, it's gonna be a close call here you guys okay few 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 luckily we narrowly fit under this bridge you guys but we are roaring through the main city as you can see here is the main town over here it is known for the skyscrapers that reach very high altitudes and they are very well built i mean it is just a great place to live and there are so many people that live here as well so we are exploring through the town i mean this is just so cool there is another famous bridge over here that our vessel absolutely would not fit under so we are going to be doing a U-turn right over here, and we are going to be headed back to the beach area where we were earlier, you guys. So there is going to be food service in just a few minutes, guys. We are having a very good chicken tender dinner, and also you can get optional french fries for a $2 value. So make sure you guys head to the cafeteria on the super yacht right now. I'm gonna put the boat on autopilot, and we should be set to go, everybody. So we are roaring through the ocean. The boat is literally on autopilot right now. We are enjoying dinner. How's the food, Lincoln? Oh, it is pretty good. I got the fresh crab. Oh my gosh. I'm getting the 
chicken tenders because they are very famous here. I mean, they are well known on this super yacht here. Oh my gosh. Um, guys, the yacht is headed towards the beach. Whoa! Whoa! Oh, oh my word! Oh my word! Oh my word! Oh my word! Are you serious right now? The yacht is literally stuck in the middle of the beach. This is not good at all. This is not good at all. Uh, we need to report this to the state police. This is not good. Oh my gosh. The boat is literally stuck. Grab your things, you guys. We gotta get off the boat as fast as we can. Oh my gosh. We need a helicopter rescue. Get me out of here, please. Oh my gosh, you guys. This is not good. Get me to the beach. We'll have to send another helicopter over to pick up Uncle Lincoln. Guys, this is absolutely unbelievable. I cannot believe we are literally stuck in the middle of the beach. Yeah, I am okay. Oh my gosh. You know, the boat is severely damaged. We'll have to check it out. Oh my goodness, you guys. I cannot believe this has happened. I set the boat to autopilot and it literally crashed into the middle of the beach. Uh, Uncle Lincoln is being picked up by the emergency helicopter right now. I mean, I've never seen something like this in my entire life, you guys. Look at how gigantic this super yacht is and it's literally stuck in the middle of the beach. It is starting to smoke and fill up the air this is not good at all you guys as you can see the vessel is completely broken mm. right there i mean it is just stuck completely they are probably gonna have to get something to pull this out of the beach you know there is no way that they can get this out by using the engine oh my gosh son i cannot believe this has happened they have sent some more emergency crews over up ahead and they are going to be checking from our passengers let me go check if there's any other passengers here okay I mean, this is just insane. I cannot believe this has happened to us. Oh my goodness. Well, let's check if there's any more passengers in the boat. Make sure everybody got off safely. You know, this is insane. I've never seen something like this in my entire life. As you can see, the boat is completely stuck. It looks like there's a news chopper over ahead and they are reporting live on this coverage here. I cannot believe this. We have a witness here, a Lincoln Town Car. What do you believe of the situation that well, happened here? I'm going to faint. It's just um, the boat and the, the beach. It all happened uh, so quick. Yes. What What did it feel like on the boat when it crashed into the beach? It felt like a hurricane, honestly, and a tornado as well as a tsunami all in one. Oh my goodness. That is absolutely insane. Looks like all passengers have evacuated the boat Ooh. safely and we are reported to be safe. Everyone on the vacation is going to be getting a refund for the damages here. Uh, I think we gotta fly to get our vehicle back because it is right down the road. So fly back to get our G-Wagon. You know, I cannot believe this vacation is completely ruined. Thanks to the autopilot. Oh my gosh, now it is starting to storm here horribly. We are having poor visibility. It is not looking too good here. Oh my gosh, lightning! Whoa! Oh my gosh, guys, this is scary. We can hardly see up ahead. The helicopter is being thrown across the sky right now. Whoa, there's lightning! Oh my gosh, be careful! Oh my word. Where did we park? I think we parked down there. Oh, we just hit a building, we just hit a building. Oh my word, this is not good. You need to get us back to our vehicle. It's right over here. It should be right in this parking lot somewhere over here. Oh my goodness, you guys. This is absolutely insane. We can hardly see anything. Oh my gosh. There's our vehicle. There's our vehicle. We are literally landing right now and we are going to be getting back in our vehicle. Guys, this is absolutely insane. I've never experienced a family vacation quite like this one. We were literally trying to enjoy ourselves driving a super yacht but it did not turn out too good at all. So we are going to try and get on the main road right now. Son, can you believe this vacation? I honestly cannot. Unbelievable. We were literally trying to enjoy ourselves. Oh my gosh. We gotta turn off the headlights here and we are going to get back to the house. Guys, they said get to your house as fast as you can because there is going to be flooding in the town. Oh, 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 oh. oh my word, oh my word, oh my word, oh my word. I did not see anything ahead of us. Oh my gosh, the car! It's smoking! Oh my gosh. I think I gotta try and start it up and let me see if it's okay. Oh my gosh. Start it up. This one's built very well, I guess. I cannot believe this has happened to us, you guys. We literally could not see anything ahead of us. That's how bad these storms were. Uh, we'll definitely have to get this vehicle fixed at Joe's Mechanic Shop because, I mean, it is completely busted in the front of it. But we are going to be arriving at our rental house in just a moment. These storms are horrific. 
and you know they just ruined our vacation. You know the boats got a horrible accident as well. So I mean this vacation is ruined. But we're gonna try and enjoy the best of it that we can. But we are going to get there as fast as we can. We're literally maxing the G wagon right now because we cannot afford to be out in this horrible weather at all. I mean it is just not good at all. We're getting on the main highway right now. So can you believe this? I am scared as well. You know, there's nobody on the road but us. We are literally the only ones. There was a major lightning and thunder up ahead of us. Guys, this is one of the worst storms that has ever came to Driving Empire that we have ever seen in our entire lives. You literally cannot see two feet in front of us. Thank goodness we got great headlights and are able to see. But you guys, this is not good at all. I cannot believe this has happened today. You know, our vacation is completely ruined. So we are trying to find our way back to our house right now. I think we gotta take this exit over here. I know, thankfully we got the optional AMG Plus headlights. They are very good for stormy weather. All right, we're taking the exit over here. Oh my goodness, we literally still could not see. Hopefully the storm will clear up soon. Guys, we gotta get off the highway right over here. Hopefully this will lead us to our house. I think we are completely lost. Our navigation system has lost connection. I mean, look at this weather, you guys. It is unbelievable. All right, let's go this way. We're trying to find our way back home. We are getting very lost throughout the city here. Son, is this the right way? Check your phone map. Keep trying to get to work. I mean, we are just getting lost by the minute here. Oh my word. Keep going straight in. We should be arriving at a house here soon. Oh my gosh, we're like in the middle of the country. There is nobody on the roads right now. They're saying they are having, whoa! Oh my gosh, we almost drove off the highway and that would have not been good at all. Thank goodness we got the lane departure warning as well. Oh my goodness, you guys. We are roaring down the road and we are trying to find our way back home. Whoa! Oh my goodness, we're trying to, oh, we hit a sign, we hit a sign, we're okay. We're okay. All right, you guys. Well, we are having some major troubles trying to find our way back to the house. I think we're just gonna have to head back to Greenville, Wisconsin because this is insane here. Town is going to be flooded by 50 feet of water. I mean, you'll have to get your snorkel gear to get to the grocery store. So we are roaring down the road right now, and we will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for watching, everybody, and we'll see you later. Don't forget to subscribe. Join the Wanny family today. Bye, everybody.